it's finally come, but hopefully, <laughs> hopefully this fits. So this is a uh, new order. God, two and a half months ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, feels like forever. Um, it literally feels like forever. See, I, I, I bought it from AliExpress. Um, I was going to buy one from, from Vehicle Revolution because I, I know their stuff's going to be um, decent quality and they normally have it in stock, but they've been out of stock and uh, they've been out of stock for a while, so I don't know when they were going to get me in. So I, I kind of took a risk and ordered one from AliExpress. <laughs> Never had. Looks like a white ball. That's Never funny. had any um, any good communication from the supplier at all, so I didn't know whether this was going to actually apply or not. It was on a, a ten to twenty day shipping. So it's taken took them um, took them about six to eight weeks to ship it. I think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I thought I was going to get it in three weeks. So let's have a look. So far, this is in one piece. Just looking at the back. So. Piece. There you go. Is it real carbon fibre? Yeah. Real carbon fibre, you can see the weave in, in the back. You see, oh, okay. there's, there's some carbon fibre bits. So, I just need to clean this up. It's a bit dusty. Looks badass. Yeah. You can see there's some thin bits. Um, we hold this up to the light. So if you come here, if you look inside there, oh, you can see through it. Can you get close? So here, you can see where it's a little bit thin. I don't know what they're all like, but the yeah, I can see I can see you get she through it slightly in the little oh, areas. Oh, I can as well. I can. So yeah. Mm. Okay. So it might be worth me um, putting some black spray down there mm -hmm. just to pose that in. You can tell anyway, but. That's going to be strong enough. I think so. <laughs> yeah, it's not 100% not best quality. I see a few little pits in the gel coat or the resin. But hey, you know, it's, it's at the bottom of the car. <laughs> so it's probably going to get scratched the buggery anyway from, mm -hmm. from stones and stuff, right? So that. For the money, it's, <laughs> it's not too bad. But I could have spent spent more money, and I don't know if I would have got the same quality or not. Because you don't know if the company that you were looking at would order from AliExpress themselves, well, anyway. Or the same sort of supplier that makes these. So they mm. would have come from China anyway. Yeah. But maybe this one's. Maybe this one's almost like a factory second or something. Uh, and they get sold off cheaper. Don't know. But either way, it's got some nice big fins on it. It's the, it's the XFRS st style, I'm going to say. It's got a nice curve to it, which is uh, 
And I believe a better curve than what's on the car at the moment because I think it comes down more than around. I'm not sure I'll have to check that when I get the one off. But yeah, seems quite good. Cool. See if it fits. <laughs> Right, so holding the diffuser on there's four of these which I've already tried undoing them but they're struggling to they just don't move so I'm gonna have to prize prize them out of this reset them after but yeah I'll prize them out of this hopefully yours might, might be worth getting some new ones um, ready before you do yours but anyway I'm going to put this down. Time to get the big guns out. Yeah, those little plastic things aren't quite good enough. I've got two of them out. I just need to get the rest. But look, see, there's a... Uh, the ends are just rounding off when I'm trying to undo them. So basically, it's a screw within this. So I've, I've prized it out, taken the screw back out ready, so that can go back in. I can push this back in, it'll be fine. I said it'll be fine just before I broke the, <laughs> the next one, having to use that bugger. But, oh well, it's going on. I'm gonna get some new ones anyway. So this is what they should do. They should unscrew and come in. Then that comes out. Then you can pull this out easily. That's what should happen. Just wish the others did the same. Oh well. Okay, so looking at this one, which is the new one, there's two retaining clips thing features here. Possibly that one. These don't look in great shape. I should do the trick when I get there. Obviously every single one of these isn't gonna have the retention clip, they're just for lining me up. But I need to these are obviously mimicking the real ones, so I need to unclip these first and then hopefully the rest will come out. So, I'm going to put my hand up underneath, behind, see what I can feel. I can feel one. Yeah, there's a feature on the back. I can't feel the other one as well. A lot of dirt there, as you'd expect, but I could definitely feel a clip which I need to try and remove. Uh, I don't want to break this just in case the other one doesn't fit. I want to keep this as a spare anyway. Let's just find the retention clip. Now, right, let's give this a go. So I think I'll grab it from behind and there I should be able to just pull it towards me. Oh yeah, there you go. Oh. Try that again. Sorry. out so I've got to just try and figure out how to get the others out. I, I think I need two hands. clips are breaking a little bit. Oh really? Yeah, but I'd rather that than the, um, the actual thing break itself.
Looks like the clips will line up. That's good. Biggest bastard. <laughs> yeah, it's um it does fit in there. So um so guys the it does fit, but it's a bitch to fit. The, the old one was hard to take off because the, some of the clips were actually been kind of um, kind of sealed in. You know, it had some sort of sealant on there, like tiger seal or whatever. Um, so they weren't coming out. Um, so some of them broke. Um, and I had to make the hole again, basically, because they were kind of stuck in there and glued in. Uh, this, these, the tabs on these, uh, some of them were quite thick. It was difficult to, to engage but it's in there and it's staying on the only thing is the quality of this one compared to the vehicle revolution one I've seen theirs looks very 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 good um, and this one the the resin you can see some slight imperfections in there some little bubbles and stuff like that uh, and the vehicle revolution one didn't have that but this was a lot cheaper. I took a punt. I uh, thought we'd give it a go. From a distance, you're not going to see. So, not too bad. I'm not 100% happy, but it'll do, right? It does right. look pretty badass. To it be does honest. look pretty badass. Um, just hope it stays on. We'll see. See what happens. If it falls off, I'll put the old one back on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll see what happens. Or I can just glue it on, right? But it still cost me uh, 230 quid. Oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ. But uh, I think the vehicle revolution one, when it's in stock, is 350. So I think if I had the money and they had them in stock, then I would have went to them. So, but you know, you win some, you lose some. It took months to come. Um, yeah, vehicle revolution all the way. I think if you've got the money, do it properly. All right. Anyway, that's it from me. Uh, on to the spoiler next. Uh, hopefully I'll, I'll tackle that this weekend and fit it, but that's going to be a bitch as well. So. Oh, yeah. <laughs> At least the car won't look naked, yeah, though. I know. <clears throat> right then. <laughs> See you later, guys. Bye.